Yes, and that was You Are Good by Israel Houghton. Uh, you are tuned into Agape FM. The time now is exactly 1 p.m. in Port Elizabeth stroke Kabeha. I don't know how to say Kabeha, so pardon me. How do you say it, Babsi? Kabeha. Say it again. Kabeha. 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 Oh, <laughs> cool. I'm learning. <laughs> <laughs> so, um... Today we've got an interesting guest. As, is, as you know, the midday talk session, uh, we bring amazing people, young and old, um, ladies and gents, uh, doing incredible things in the Bay. Uh, we actually are a radio station that actually want to foster this. We actually want to encourage uh, inno innovation. We want to encourage creativity, entrepreneurship, and everything. Um, creative. We are in the Creative Hub in Port Elizabeth. Um, who do we have in studio today? Um, today we are blessed to have Babalua Mani. I'll just read her bio quickly so we can all, uh, our viewers and also our listeners can get uh, an idea who uh, Babalua is. So Babalua is the founder of Money Photography and co-owner of BNN Decor Events. In 2019, she discovered she had a passion for photography and subsequently pursued uh, that passion by learning along the way which has enhanced her as a photographer. In 2020, she started her own photography business with the ambition of one, one day starting her own studio. Soon, she realized that there was a huge gap of opportunities within the photography industry because of the presence of other female photographers. She anticipates and intends on doing collaborative work with those photographers. She wishes to work with other photographers around South Africa. Wow, that's incredible, Babalo. Uh, welcome to the studio today. Thank you very much. Thank you. How are you feeling? I'm feeling nervous, a bit of nervous, but I'm going to be cool. I'm going to be fine. Cool. It's lovely, lovely to have you here. Uh, well, viewers, if you have, um, if you are on Facebook, you'll be able to see who I'm talking to. Uh, Babsi, uh, please, if you can tell us um, a little bit about yourself. Who is Babsi? Where did you come from? How did you grow up, you know, to, to come to where you are right now? Um... I'm Babalo Mani, as mm -hmm. you said. Yeah. Um, I live in Motherwell. I was born here in PE, though. Yeah. Yeah. Um, ever since uh, my childhood was 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 based um, around Christianity. I don't mm. know anything um, uh, other than Christianity mm. because when I was young, I went to Sunday school. Mm. I went to youth. Mm. You know, everything about me was based in in, in Christianity. Mm. So. Um, there is no other language I understand better mm. than me engaged in engaging church. with God and mm. fellowship, friends and yeah. everything around me. It's just church, 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 church. <laughs> other other um, other youngsters they see that as boring, mm. you know, mm. because you 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 it's like whatever that you do, you do around church, mm. your friends mm. are at church, mm. everything, you know. Yeah. But for me, it has, it has been a, 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 a great experience. It has been a great, um, um, it has helped me in a way mm. because there are things that I haven't been involved with because of, of, of my upbringing, mm. you know, so, yeah. Cool. Uh, in your biography, you do say that uh, you are the founder of Babalo money photography, uh, what what is what is that to like uh, um, uh, somebody out there who has no idea what a photography business is, and also that you are a co-owner of B and N Decor Events. We're gonna come to that, but let's deal with the photography first. What is Babalo money photography? Babalo money photography um, is a business that I started um, um, last year. Mm. It was around March, mm. um, but there's a story behind me starting my business. Okay, let's right? go for it. Yeah. Um, it was last of last year, March around April. Mm. So we went um, every time um, the pass the the Passover mm. um, um, comes. We suppose. 
to go to 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 other cities like Cape Town mm. for a conference. Mm. So it was that time for me. So I went um, to Cape Town yeah. for a church conference. But the sad part the sad part was that um, I was really struggling financially, mm -hmm. and. It, it was supposed to be exciting because of I was one of the speakers there, mm, right? Mm, but mm. for me, it wasn't because of I didn't have territories, mm, I didn't have clothes, mm, I didn't have nothing. Mm, and you know, as ladies, when yeah, it's passed yeah, over I and you're going to meet other people, yes. you have to look gorgeous, yeah, you know? know. So I, I told my pastor, no, I, I can't go to Cape Town because I don't have any finances. Mm. But because of they are very nice people. They made a way. So mm -hmm. I went to Cape Town to cut their story short. I went to Cape Town mm -hmm. and then came back. Yeah. And my spirit was very down. Mm -hmm. And I asked myself, why am I feeling so down? Because I'm, I'm coming from a mm -hmm. huge conference, yes, you know. Yes. But I'm supposed to be spiritually high. Yes, but I'm very yes, down. Yes. And 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 something inside me tells me you're not supposed. You're not where you're supposed to be. Mm. Financially, you you you. It's bad. Okay. Um, and, 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 and your age, you, mm. you, you, at least you're supposed to be some, and Somewhere, if, yes, yeah. and if you're not where you're supposed to be, you, you don't really relax, you mm. panic, I know. right? Mm -hmm. So I prayed about it, um, mm. and said, Lord, no, man, this is not it. Mm. This is not it. I want to mm. do something about my yeah. life. Mm. And I'm not really sure what is it right now, but mm. I want to do something. Mm. And then, um, there was this guy mm. who was doing also a photography at church, mm. not at my church, mm. but the church that yeah, I fellowship with. Yeah. Mm. And I knew that I had passion for photography, mm. but I didn't know where mm. I would get money for, for, mm. for camera. Yeah, I, I didn't know where I'm going to start doing this. Yeah. I didn't know because I knew that no one would just come and give me 5000 and say, Baba, I'll go and buy a camera. Mm. So... One day we were we were coming from church with this guy, keep mm. a prayer in my church, and then and then he said to me, You know what? You've got hands, you can make money mm. by your hands. You 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 always think that there's gonna come someone who's gonna give you money mm. or someone blesses you. No, mm. just use mm. your hands. Mm. And in my mind I thought, No, sorry. Mm. Mm -hmm. I don't know, he was just talking about me selling sweets and mm -hmm. stuff, mm -hmm. which is there's nothing wrong, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. But, hey, selling sweets cheap so that I can raise the <laughs> money to buy a camera, is it, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. So, yeah. what I did, an opportunity popped, yeah. right? Yeah. Uh, there was this guy who gave me textbooks mm -hmm. and said, you can sell these textbooks. Mm -hmm. Hey, sell textbooks. Mm -hmm. So I went to school. When I went to school, mm -hmm. I got there there was already guys there. Mm, mm. First challenge that you face as a woman. Mm. There were already guys there. Mm. They were selling textbooks at the gate. Yo. And I stood there and I said, Lord, I'm not going to sell textbook at the mm. gate. I'm mm. a lady. No, <laughs> I can't. You have to make a way. You know? So I went inside. That is not allowed. Mm. That is mm. not allowed. Mm. So I went inside and, and I was just hoping to see a manager so that I can, you yeah, know? Yeah, I know. To cut the story short, I mm. sold the, those textbooks. About wow. a week, I made 3.5. Wow. Made 3.5. It was for, 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 for some other ladies, mm. they would never do that. Mm. Like sell textbook. Mm. Everyone is passing by. Yeah, Everyone yo, is passing by. I and know. then you just... And then, how much is this? Like, it's 200. How much is it? <laughs> you know those things. But yeah. I, 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 I was so courageous. And I did it. And I got 3 point something. And then I, I saw a post, an advert on, 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 on Facebook, mm. Cash Crusader is mm. selling camera. Mm. No, it was just God. Hallelujah. It was just God. Mm. So mm. tomorrow morning I went to Cash Crusader, I bought my camera. Mm. And when I wanted to start, mm. COVID kicked no. in. Okay, just before COVID came in, mm. uh, tell us of uh, the experience and your feeling uh, like you know having your own camera you know and stuff like you know you've worked hard for mm. this how did that feel was it must have been i felt so happy mm. and i felt like i've i've made um those other photographers proud mm. who were helping me because there were guys who were helping me mm. if they 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 had a gig they mm. would say babala come uh -huh. uh, and then you use, use, the use it yeah okay. babala this okay. is how you well, that's how you were learning yes yes yeah. right. so when i got my own camera it wasn't like 
what can yeah. I do with this yes. thing? What? Yeah, you know. You so I was, all, oh yeah, so I was, I was, I was already familiar mm, with the camera. Mm, mm. So that that was the the the, the, the moment where I said, Lord, mm. you have heard my prayers. Mm. You know, I I didn't go to my parents and ask for a man, a mm, man for camera. Mm, I didn't. Mm. I didn't ask it for anything, but I made it mm, myself, yeah. you know. Mm, and 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 it was so clear that God heard my prayer when mm, I prayed, Lord, mm, I need the financial breakthrough. Amen. So yeah. Amen. Okay, so um, now you started. Mm -hmm. How did you start? And you said you mentioned something about COVID. COVID mm -hmm. hit. You wanna take us from that point? How did you start, and how was it? Okay, as I was already excited mm. about starting my own business, yes. and then around March there was, uh, what's this level one, yeah. something like that. Yes, so. Meaning we 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 not allowed to go to the parks. We not mm. allowed. So I'm oh. also restricted not to go to the parks. Whereby mm. it's where I work, yes. like parks, mm. um, beach, mm. you know. Mm. So I was like, Lord. What am I gonna do? Mm, you know, mm, mm. and then hey, it was all, it was so amazing. Mm. I, I received calls. Mm. Maybe it's because I was affordable at that time. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> but my my phone kept on ringing, kept on ringing, kept on ringing. Mm. You know, and uh, things started happening. Yes, okay. very well, very That's well. That's really good. Very That's well. I'm so I'm so happy to hear that for you. You know, like mm. I, I always I'm excited. You know when. Uh, an entrepreneur starts, you know, mm. something and it begins to work. You know, yeah. it was first because this is something that was not there, mm. it didn't exist. You created something, mm. and that something is making money not mm. only for yourself, maybe your family or a couple of people, I'm you know, you know are, are around. Yeah. You know, mm. so um, uh, you said COVID affected you in terms of like, okay, cool, there were now restrictions, yeah. uh, social distancing, mm. you can take crowd photos. Mm and beach, you know, at the beach and at the parks. Um, how did you go about it? How, you know, did you use innovation, for example? You know, uh, well, if we cannot do that, we can do something, you yeah. know, to make money still. What, what I did, mm. uh, I had to be creative. Mm. That's mm. the thing. Mm. Now, I made, I made my customers, you know what, guys? Mm. It's it, we're gonna have good pictures if we take them here around mm, mm. here in the streets, like okay. around. We mm, don't have to mm, go to Summer mm, Strand, mm. we don't have to go to San Judges Park, we don't mm. have to go Bear West, mm. but we can do it here. Mm. You know, if mm. there's a park here mm. near, we mm. can do it there. Mm. We can do a picnic there. Like, mm. I had to be creative, mm. you know, mm. but I had to convince my clients, mm. Mm. right? Mm. I yes. had to convince yes, them, sure. and I, I I had a, 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 an opportunity for me to 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 think out of the box mm. about it. So, mm. to be honest, mm. as much as it affected other people, mm. it didn't affect me. I don't know how business just. I don't I don't know how, but it just didn't affect me. I think it was just time. Hallelujah. And, and when it's got time, nothing can stop God's mm. timing. And the grace of God. That's that's one thing. Yeah. You know, it's what sets you apart. Mm. Ultimately, it is what sets you apart. Um, and uh, please, uh, if we can go just a few steps back, mm. sorry, you know, for doing that. Yeah. Uh, you mentioned something about that you in twenty nineteen uh, you realized that you had a passion mm. for photography. How did that happen? How did that realization kick in? Okay. Mm. Um. As I said, there were guys who were doing photography at church. Mm, mm. There were two guys though. Mm. So every time I saw them doing photography, I I had the, I had that thing in my inside me like, I love this thing. Mm, mm. I wouldn't even mind even even doing it without for 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 not, no for not for, yes mm, you know mm, because of, mm, I love this thing mm, mm, and mm. but the problem was. So if there's any girl who's doing photography, yeah. Yeah. so what's going to happen? Mm, then mm. what happened is that I, I went to this youth, youth conference at AFM. Yes. When I got there, I saw a lady yeah. doing photography. And I was, yes, yes, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. 
I'm gonna do it. Now there's no obstacle that is 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 is, is standing in my no way. I'm gonna excuse. do gonna it. Go I'm gonna. It. So mm. then I was like crazy. People were like, oh, what, what is this about photography? Guys, mm. you don't understand. Mm. I wanna do photography. <laughs> so wow. mm. yeah, my passion grew and grew and grew and grew and grew. Mm. Wow. Yeah. So, uh, also in your bio, you know, in your bio, it says in twenty twenty, you started your own photography business, mm -hmm. okay, with the ambition of one day starting your own studio. Yes. So, how far in the journey are we, you know, uh, from when you started to starting your own studio? How far? I'm halfway. Halfway. I'm not Ooh. gonna lie. Uh, I'm not gonna yeah. lie. I'm yeah. being honest. Mm. My business is doing very. Hallelujah. And and the support that I'm getting, maybe it's because of immunity. I don't know. <laughs> I, don't, I really don't know. But the support that I'm getting is 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 is, is very huge, and I, I'm so grateful. Mm. And I I, I I I even imagine sometimes when I'm home, maybe what are they saying about me? No mm. man, let's support that lady. There's a lady in photography. Let's just go to to her and and support her. Maybe it's what they're saying. I don't mm. know. Mm. But besides mm. that, that I know that my my work is very mm. is very good. Mm. I mm. I make sure mm. that I do something that is gonna make someone else say, "Wow, mm. this girl." Mm. And and mm. and I even I even I even saw that there are other photographers that are saying, "Okay, girl." We salute you, <laughs> you know. We salute, and they're gonna die if they hear that I am opening my studio soon. They were like, uh, "Where is this girl coming from?" You know. So I'm halfway there. Mm, I'm, mm. I'm, 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 I've already started buying some equipment, wow. but I'm keeping them. But uh, the the only complication is now is the venue. Mm, mm. But I know that God is gonna. Provide. Open because there's a BNB uh, around mm. where I stay, mm. so I have to, you know what? God, go and soften that, yeah, that, that heart, <laughs> you know, so that she she can give me one one room so mm. that I, she, mm. I can use. Wow! It. So yeah. Sure, man. I'm mm. loving. I'm loving this story. Mm. You know, um, this is what we do here. You know, uh, tell people stories, and uh, you are a listener out there or viewer on Facebook. I see some people have already dropped comments on our Facebook. Um, you know, if you want to, uh, you know, contact us, uh, please WhatsApp us or SMS us on our number 67 99 So, Babsi, uh, I know um, the way business is being portrayed out there mm. is, is that we roll on money. You know, like money is all over. It's it's uh it's we laugh our way to the bank every time. You know, uh please if you can just like uh have tell us. You know, um have there been bad days and good days for you? You know what what does business look like, especially in the photography industry for someone who wants to get in it and has no idea. How can you like tell them? You know, some of the equipping. Tell them, okay, this is the reality. You know, mm. it's tough out there. You know, you just have to put yourself out there. Mm. You have to market yourself and stuff like that. Um, it's not easy mm. being a woman around guys who are doing photography. Mm. That we cannot run away. Mm. Because um, in my journey, mm. I had to work with guys because there are no ladies. Mm. There are, they are, but there are few ladies, yeah. right? Mm. Mm. And one thing that um, when someone wants to start a business, mm. it's very important work with people who have already accomplished, yeah? mm. not work with people who are in your in the same mm. level mm. as you, mm. right? Mm. And when you go and approach those people who are, you know, yes. you have to humble, humble yourself. yourself. Mm. You know, the, yeah. the, the, there's there's mm. a lesson that I've learned that mm. if you want something. Mm. If you want something, mm. even if that guy gives you attitude, mm. as long as I will get what I want, <laughs> it's fine. Mm. You know, it's, it's fine. Yeah. So you don't have to have pride when mm. you want something from someone. Mm. So mm. I've learned that I have to be humble mm. and, 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 and learn mm. and mm. learn and make sure that, okay, mm. yeah, he's got attitude, mm. but I'm going to learn what I'm, I'm here for mm -hmm. and then I'm going to leave him alone, mm. you know, and then mm. what I, 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 I was taught there, I'm mm. going to. Mm -hmm. Teach someone exactly. else, mm -hmm. and around um um, and something else is that mm -hmm. when you're running a business, you deal with people. Mm -hmm. Ah, 
different characters, <laughs> different attitude, mm. attitude. Mm. But what I said is that you have to humble yourself. That's it. Mm. Because other people, okay, the the bad days is that um, someone books me. Mm. And say, okay, about two o'clock, we're going to be so much right and do this and this and that. Mm. Okay, fine, I'll, I'll go there. Mm. And then, when I'm, I'm giving her or him pictures, mm. and then he mentioned something about, um, no, this is not what I wanted. I, I only got that once. Mm. This, is mm. what I want, this, is not a, this is not what I wanted. Mm. Mm. Um, you have to refund me. Mm. Like, no. Wow. Mm. Let's make it better. Mm. Let's redo it again. Mm. Mm. Because at, at the end of the day, it's mm. my reputation mm. here. Yeah, Let's exactly. redo it again. Exactly. No, I don't want to do it. Bring, give me back. By that time, I don't have money. <laughs> Maybe I've already used that money, you see? And I'm like, oh my God. So I have to give uh, him or her back mm. 50%, mm. you know? Whereby I'm not, I don't get excited about that because of I. It's my reputation. Mm, yeah, but it's just a misunderstanding mm, that mm, no, Babala, maybe you know, you know. So mm, it's it's part of learning. Mm, it's part of learning. It's part so of true. growing. Mm, so it's yeah. so true. And especially, uh, you know, like your industry is, a, we can call it a creative industry. Mm. Well, really, it is. Mm. You know, because. Uh, I mean, you can have two people with the same equipment, mm. or what one person does with what that equipment. Yeah, you know, yeah, it's it's all about creative, how you think, the angles, the lighting, yeah. and all this. This yes, there's skill. There's also creativity and everything around it, and also like um, it's a uh, how can I, how can you call it uh, branding and yes, and true. name. Mm. You know, is so important because um, you know you can have the same in quotes yeah. you know uh kind of shot you know like um you know uh, f you know photo shoot mm -hmm. with um you know like an, an a common you know uh let's say yeah somebody mm -hmm. and then you have with this uh, reputable or um you know like somebody who has built a name mm -hmm. and so Wait, what they charge they charge multiple times mm -hmm. Just because of the name. Yeah, so true. what you're saying is really true. incredible. So true. to you, how important is branding? As you said, you defend it with all you know that you have. As you said, you know what, you can actually redo a whole mm. shot. Mm. Just mm. not because of whatever, but I because was wrong you or the, he was yeah, wrong. but because of your name. Yeah. How is how important is that to you? Lisa? It's 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 very important. Mm. Because this thing, I'm not only doing it for money, mm, mm, right? Mm. Um, this thing, I mm. am doing it because I love it. Mm, mm. And my aim was mm. that I've got a career mm -hmm. on the other side, mm -hmm. right? Mm. So by doing this, I'm going to, you know, as I said earlier, that I've got this surrounding, mm, like Christianity, mm, salvation mm, and stuff. Mm, mm, now, there mm, are people there who aren't working, mm, who aren't getting salary, mm, who are finan who needs financially break through because mm, I was there. I mm, know it. You, uh, know, you would go you to church what? and worship. You go to church mm, and preach but you know, I don't have territory. Mm, you know? Mm, you, you see that that, that testimony. So, there are people who are going through the same mm, thing that I went yeah, through. Exactly. So, um, 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 it's not like um, I'm doing this photography just Jeff, to make money for myself, mm -hmm. but I'm also thinking about other, other people. people who can benefit mm -hmm. from, from, from this business because mm -hmm. maybe December mm -hmm. I would need someone uh, else who's going to help me mm -hmm. because maybe the, the workload is going to be extra because of, 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 uh, I've yeah. been Mm. I've been planning to open a studio, mm. so it's not going to be the same thing. Mm. Um, opening a studio and do out, out, outdoor mm. uh, shoots mm. and indoor yes. shoots at the very same. So I'm yes. going to need someone. So I'm going to take um, uh, um somebody else mm. around here, mm. and you know. Yeah. So it's not going to be me only who's going to benefit, but mm. also other, other people. people. Mm. Fantastic, yeah. fantastic. Well, uh, mm. you said that you s when you started after you started, you soon realized that there was a big gap. Mm. You know, uh, was that big gap? Uh, because there wasn't uh, a lady photographers or women photographers, or what do you mean by that? What do I mean by that? There mm. are photographers who are ladies, mm. but it, it it comes back to what you said, mm. name, mm. right? 
I don't know them. Mm. Many mm. people don't know them. Mm. You know, mm. if if I to 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 if I I, I had to to search, mm. I had to search deep that are there any ladies who are doing photography? Mm. Like I had to 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 dig mm. to to mm. know that it's mm. not like. But I'm I'm I'm, I'm gonna be that girl I when know. you mention and say, oh, we know her. Yes. I'm gonna be that girl, yes. and 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 it, it even it 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 doesn't need. Doesn't it to take years, mm. five years, six years? Mm, mm. God has made it mm. within two years. Mm. We're gonna sure. say two years mm. because I've got uh, um, I have one year doing mm. photography, mm. but now I'm gonna end of December I'll be having my own studio. Mm. So two years mm. I've accomplished all of that. Yeah. Like it's just amazing. <laughs> you know, it's just amazing. So mm. another thing, mm. there are shoots. Mm. Um, whereby there are people who are comfortable in doing those shoots mm. if they would just prefer if it was a woman. Mm. Mm. You know? Oh, yes. Yeah, you, oh, you know those yes. studio, oh, studio yes. photo shoots, uh -huh. modelers, uh -huh. they would uh -huh. prefer uh -huh. it was going to be better mm -hmm. if it was a woman. Mm -hmm. So that's where, that's where I, 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 I come in. Mm -hmm. You know, so mm -hmm. that women can be comfortable to mm -hmm. wear whatever they want yes, to wear, exactly. to, to yeah. do whatever they want to do, mm -hmm. because they know that it's it's a fellow woman. It's a fellow mm -hmm. woman. Okay, there isn't like that, you know, oh, well, this is... Yeah, uh, sometimes you, know, you, you, you get skeptical not, about yes, other exactly. poses. Yes, exactly, not be shy. You know, yeah. And also, you know, they can be themselves yeah. in front of the camera, yeah. you know. And be comfortable, mm. as you said. It's it's also quite personal, you know. Mm. Like you know, that is like something, you know. You're zooming in a lens onto somebody, mm. you know, and stuff. That is quite personal. Mm. Well, um, let's talk a little bit of the other business that you, um, you are a co-owner, the B and Deco events. What is that? Okay, B and N Deco events. It means Babalo and Nandi Pa Deco events. Okay. But I'm soon gonna change the name. But mm. we're just starting it. It's it's very new. Oh, okay. So, I had this idea. There's a. Um, I saw something. Mm. Okay? Mm. So it 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 was saying that. When God blesses you with mm. money, mm. don't raise. The standard of living, mm. but raise the standard of giving. Mm. <laughs> so <laughs> that 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 thing mm. stuck in my head, mm. in my head, and mm. I was like, I'm making money. Mm. I'm supposed to buy weaves. Mm. There's nothing wrong. Mm. Mm. Yeah? I'm supposed to 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 go vacations and stuff. Yeah? <laughs> yes, but yes. let me just take this money and do something else that so will make good. me more money. Uh, exactly. So that I can be willing to give more, right? Yes, so I started business. What what what's interesting is that mm. I'm not into deco. Mm, mm, mm. When I started the business of deco, it mm. was I wasn't thinking about me, mm, mm, but I was thinking about those girls who are mm, in church who mm, are very good mm, at doing deco, mm, but they aren't getting any money mm, out of it. Mm, I see. So it was. So I approach. It was my idea. Mm. So I approach this girl. With, I knew I knew her that she's very good mm. uh, when it when it comes to deco. Mm -hmm. So I approached her, you know what, Nandipa? Mm. I'm thinking of this. Mm. Dun, 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 dun. And I know that it's gonna be big so yes. that we can have other people, you know. Mm. Let's just eat money here, let's just do it, let's mm. let's support each other, mm. let's mm. let's build up each other, let's mm. let's you know. Mm. So she was very glad mm. and then we, we bought things. Mm. Not because of I didn't have enough money to buy all of these mm. things alone, mm. but it's because of I wanted someone else, mm. you know. To mock. Yes, mm. but we still mm. um in that. Mm. But to be honest, I don't have I don't really have time for it. Mm. You know? mm. That's mm. why I'm still looking for someone who's gonna feel in. Mm. Mm. I'm gonna learn mm. because I said I'm mm. not into, into that. Yeah, okay. whatever I'm gonna learn. So mm. I'm still looking and praying mm. to God that God please please bring me someone who's gonna be excited and, mm. and commit and this dedicate. Is, yeah, yeah but so that now yeah, every month he, she can get, you know. Mm. It doesn't matter if it's a guy or mm. if it's a woman. Mm. And it's 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 it doesn't matter. Mm. You know, so yeah. Cool. And uh, what has business or entrepreneurship uh, taught uh, or revealed uh, something you didn't know about yourself? Because I know, I know, uh, business stretches you. It really does. You know, as I said, good days, bad days, 
and sometimes the ballets can be really bad um you know and you those are like this things like perseverance mm. you, know, you know business just doesn't happen in one day yeah, you know nothing is built in one day nothing good you know is built in one day things take time yeah. you know we didn't like we're not born and all of a sudden we are where we are now mm. you know it took time to grow and to develop so what has entrepreneurship mm. uh you know revealed to you something about yourself you didn't know you didn't know you could handle certain things or could do certain things and then you did okay. it and you're like whoa whoa okay all right <laughs> mm. um as i said earlier that when you do business you meet <laughs> different characters mm. i've got my own character you know <laughs> you know i've got my own okay i've got my own whereby you know what someone can't do this to me mm. no 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 you can't mm. 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 it's me babala you can't do that but when it mm. comes to business you mm. have to put that aside mm. and put mm. business in mm. your name mm. you know mm. so i had to humble myself I'm like mm. i had to mm. I had to be a mad mm, so that mm. people can move on. <laughs> you know sometimes you 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 see that this is wrong mm. but you're not supposed to say anything because, mm. because you're dealing with a client mm. that client mm. is going to tell other people mm. that oh that girl Yo, you know <laughs> and interpret it in a wrong way so mm. another thing is that um that I've discovered about mm. myself mm. I can work under pressure mm. Mm. Yeah, but I can work under pressure. I think it was two months back when I realized I had three gigs mm. in one day. Yo. Three gigs in one Yo. day. So I was like, to other people it's an achievement, mm. but also to me it's an achievement, but pressure. Yo, mm-hmm. pressure. Yeah, no. Pressure. And everyone wants... The best. Yes, I know. No one wants uh, a sloppy mm. service. They all want, you know... Can you believe that if someone mm. goes to a photo shoot mm. today mm. and you get a message tomorrow morning mm. are the pictures ready who's like ah ah na galog it doesn't work like that you know it's it's because there's editing and yes, that goes into it yes, and stuff like okay, that okay to be honest with you it's and the, stuff. it's one thing that irritates me mm. yeah i know the editing you know yeah i know i know because Yo, it's, it's a lot of work. Yes, but yeah. they don't understand that, mm-hmm. but I have to explain it. Mm-hmm. So you know what? You're going to get your pictures after three days. Sure. And please mm-hmm. wait for me. I'm going to send you pictures mm-hmm. immediately they are ready, mm-hmm. you know? So, yeah, man. Mm-hmm. Under pressure, mm-hmm. character wise. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It pulls you and stretches yeah. you. Yeah. <laughs> Cuz I know. Uh, you know as you said, uh, uh being understanding, you know, to different personalities, different mm. like there's some people who are very snappy, you mm. know, who are like, you know, uh, you know like I pay for it, yeah, so I want so you have to deliver. Yes, you mm. know, and stuff like that. And then there's people that you know that are don't communicate you know like you know they they're not good communicators you know you have to guess you know where they are and you know when True. are they going to pay yeah. sending an invoice mm. or all these things mm. so um if i may ask in now on the business side how do you put yourself out there apart from your good work you know mm-hmm. cuz good work markets for itself yeah. and uh which also and word word of mouth your, your friends mm. and 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 you know happy clients mm. is there any other way you know that you market yourself um other way mm. um okay right mm. there is this time mm. where most of people didn't know that there is babalo mm. Mm. then i had to sacrifice that mm. i would I would search for an mm. event mm. that yeah. okay. that uh, that is yeah, that I is full I of know, people, <laughs> and then I would talk to the pastor or someone there yeah, and says, "Can I come in?" And yes. you know, it's yeah. and they will be excited because mm. it's free, mm. you know, know, you know? know. So it has really worked for me mm. doing mm. that. It mm. has really worked for me. Mm. So I think that was one of the biggest thing that has worked for mm. me. Mm. Yeah, one. Well, 
So yeah, even when it comes to this deco thing, mm. I'm also planning to do it free, mm. so mm. that people can know. But now, okay, this is Baba mm. and work. Mm -hmm. Oh, all right, you know. Mm. Yes, we bought the equipment very expensive, mm. but somewhere somehow we have to mm. to sacrifice to to yes. be recognized, exactly. you know. And exactly. it's gonna pay mm. off. It's gonna pay off well mm. Mm. at the end of the day. Yeah, so it's sure. worth it. Yeah, yeah. it's it's we call it in business risk taking. Mm. You have to uh, uh, say uh, lose some to earn some. Yeah. You know, which now when we're talking about that, like you know, uh, getting into events, you know, we usually say you go with your business cards or flyers. Mm -hmm. You know, these are the services you offer, and these are the price tags. Mm -hmm. But you're getting it for free. You would have paid this, but you are getting it for free. Okay, <laughs> that's really incredible. Okay, cool. Uh, we've been uh, discussing thirty five minutes into it. The conversation is just getting better and better. I'm loving it. Um, so, um, what would you say from your experience? Uh, there, there is not so much women entrepreneurs as men, mm -hmm. you know, and you are one fantastic example. You know, what can you tell to our sisters? You know, it doesn't have to be photography. It could be braiding, it could be doing nails, it could be uh, consulting, you know, anything whatsoever. You mm -hmm. know, as you said, you turned your passion into business, you know, True. and you've seen that it can be really successful. What can you tell our sisters and even brothers, you know, out there who's listening to us right now, watching mm. it, that, you know, go out there. You don't have to wait for someone. Mm. You, you get get proactive. You don't have to wait for funds to come from yeah. you. Get, get you. Get busy with whatever you have now and make a life for yourself. What can I say is that it mm. all starts small. Mm. It didn't make sense when that guy said to me in the mm. car, Baba mm. Lua, mm. you've got hands. Mm. Mm. Start doing something that will give you money with your hands. <laughs> and because of my mind was thinking, oh, he wants me to sell sweets, mm. he wants to, which is there's nothing wrong. Yes. Eh? Yes. But he was just um, um, elaborating that mm. there's a lot that you can do with mm. your hands. Mm. You know, mm, so mm. I want to say to someone out there, mm. please don't think big. Mm, Let's mm. start small. Mm. Think small. Mm. What can you do? Mm, mm. There's this scripture. Mm. There was a, there's a there was a woman mm. who was a widow, if I'm not mistaken, yes, yes. and 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 the husband, the mm. late husband, mm. left her mm. with 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 money that mm. she has to pay mm. right mm. and then there's this prophet who oh, came yes. yeah. and then and and, and 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 this prophet said what do, do you, you have, have? <laughs> meaning use what you have to pay anything mm. any debt mm. use mm. what you have mm. use what you have you don't have to go and extra mm. and ask for mm. money you don't have to go and mm. and ask for equipment mm. use what you have and it's gonna work out for you mm. i mean what you're saying is incredible Mm. Uh, it works every time. Mm. Every time. You don't have to... Yes, dream big, start small. Yes. Start small. Don't don't think that that big dream is going to happen tomorrow. Overnight, you know, yeah. it's overnight. Mm. No, it will happen soon mm. after you've walked the road, after you started small and grew to become it. And at the end of the day, you mm. need a testimony. Yes. There has to be a testimony. Yes, exactly. You have to tell it. But now, you know what, guys? Mm. I, I started there and mm. it, the challenges was there so mm. that it can help another person. Mm. So you cannot expect things to go smoothly so mm. that you cannot have a testimony. Mm. That the reason why I'm pushing, even mm. if it's hard, mm. even if my body, I feel that my body is very mm. exhausted Tired, because yeah. I'm also mm. studying at the other side. Mm. But it's because of I've got a testimony sure. and God opened doors for me. I cannot mm. disappoint God. Mm. You know, mm. I cannot disappoint God. And I, I believe there's a scripture that says, do not worry about tomorrow for mm. tomorrow will worry about Somebody itself. <laughs> right? Ooh, <Matthew> Meaning, <laughs> God has given us yeah. your mind to think about what you're going to do. Mm -hmm, you know, mm -hmm. God has given us something to do. Mm -hmm. But you have to ask God, what is it that you want me to do? Mm -hmm. What do I have? Mm -hmm. Because we cannot expect everyone to know that. Maybe there are people who are asking, Aibo, what do I have? What do I have? Like, mm -hmm. you know, mm -hmm. you have to go and ask God, what do I have? Mm -hmm. Because I had to go and ask God, Lord, I need the camera. Mm -hmm. But what can I do? Then mm -hmm. an opportunity pops. Mm -hmm. And even that opportunity was not smooth. Mm -hmm. I had 
to lower myself mm, yeah. my and go to school and stand and sell textbooks <laughs> oh my word a lady selling textbooks to get money but it's it was worth it you know so it's not you're not going to do something that is always comfortable mm, and mm, smooth you know mm, but mm. as long as you're going to get mm, it and you've sure. got a testimony mm. usually and you know um usually you see these things in retrospect you know mm. when you look at the rear view mirror you're like i did that hey. you know i did that <laughs> i mean this has been built no. from that no. uh you know way you know the pride of many people gets in their way mm. to their success yeah, you know because uh some people are like you know what i know i want it but me going do that mm, no, no. <laughs> you know no, and they, that is actually the shutting mm. the very door that they need to walk through to get there sure. because you cannot be a leader unless you have served yeah. you know uh and and serving wh- whatever it is being humble yeah. you know humility is the yeah. doorway to honor you know um, that's sure. what the bible says mm-hmm. you know uh humility honor comes uh you know um so humility comes before honor mm. and pride before a fall yeah. you know so um it's it's been an incredible uh uh testimony that you you've shared with us mm-hmm. of uh you know babalua mani uh photography uh how can people reach to you you know how can people get to you like we've got a viewer right now listening right now listening to you mm-hmm. and they're like well i mean uh, i've got an anniversary mm-hmm. coming soon or whatever any this event coming soon I'm hearing your testimony and I actually want to bless you on a support mm-hmm. on a partner with you on a you know I want you to take uh photos and how can people contact you Oh okay I've got a business page on Facebook mm. which, which is called Babala Mani Photography mm. and also on Instagram which is Babala Mani Photography mm. um I've got a poster there on my page that mm. has my all, that has my details mm. but people can reach me on my WhatsApp Mm. Uh my number is 0679928099. Mm. So say that again. 0679998099. Mm. So okay. you can talk to me there, inbox me or Facebook mm. or my personal Facebook mm. um, um which is Babalwa Mani. Mm. Babalwa B Mani. Babalwa B Mani. Yes. Awesome. It's been a wonderful session. Uh ladies and gents, uh it's now 41 42 minutes uh into the uh midday talk uh it's been fantastic to have babalo money today of babalo money photography guys please flock in support her if you want your photos uh, uh and stuff you don't have to go to anyone you've heard her story first and support this uh, dear woman of god mm-hmm. achieve the dreams that god has given her let Babalo Mani start her studio soon. Right, guys. <laughs> so support her. This is going to be really incredible. Yeah. It's a pleasure for us to do things like this. Uh, contact us on our number 067-99-4546. If you have a business, a ministry, a story that you want uh, you know, shared on this platform, we are here for that. Uh, God bless. And uh, we're going to listen to Intentional by Travis Green. It's adios, adios for us.